my new CD. Um, it's called Grinding Smoke. Um, I've just finished recording it. Um, recorded it in Bristol with a uh, young producer called Dave Colebrook. He used to be at a, a studio called uh, Audio Shelter. Um, and um, the cover is um, it's based on a Charlie's self-portrait he did when he was nine, and we really liked it. Yeah, and um, it lived on the fridge for a couple of years or a year, um, but it was really striking. Um, so that's 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 what's on the front of the, the cover. So, what's the new album called? It's called Grinding Smoke. Um, do you want to like explain what that means? Um, it doesn't mean much really. Grinding Smoke is um, people talk about things that are nonsense um, as things like um, a machine for grinding smoke, so there's no such thing. But it can mean whatever you want it to mean. Um, people talk about the city as being the smoke, so like um, working every day, working hard is like um, the grind, so it's the grinding smoke. Um, it, it can mean lots of different things, really. Are they all your own songs on the album? Yeah, there's a lot of songs on the album. I wrote the one which I co-wrote with Don, so we put Bob Rips. So that particular song, Candy Girl, was written well, over 10 years ago. Actually, yeah, I like um, a track called Gridlocked. Has it been recorded locally, your album? Yeah, and so it was recorded with um, a producer called Dave Colbert in Bristol. Um, and it's taken me about a year to record. Um, and it was mastered, it was mastered by um, a studio called Get Real, um, which is on, it's, it's, it's our end of town, it's sort of, um, sort of like, all, like all area. What kind of like kicked off your like interest in music? Like, were you interested in early age? Uh, yeah, always like? really. Um, when my dad, your granddad, used to sing all the time, that probably got me interested. Um, and I played the saxophone when I was about, started learning when I was 12, and then I bought my first guitar when I was about 15. So, are there any saxophones featuring on the album? No. Or just, just guitars? <laughs> just guitars. I mean, it's, it's all sort of guitar based, really. I might get my saxophone again, and uh, on the next one, which I'm already working on, which is more um, more acoustic, but I'm, I'm picking up lots of um, old 70s and 80s disco songs and, and kind of uh, reworking them. Valerie, Valerie. 